Welcome to the new episode of Our Adventures! When you think about small fish, you obviously think of cute and colorful fish swimming peacefully all together. You can't imagine that even the smallest fish can be as brutal and violent as the hungriest shark in the entire world. Uh, wait, small disclaimer. I love sharks. They are amazing and misunderstood animals. Of course, they are predators so they need to be treated with respect, because approaching them could be dangerous. That said, this time I will tell you a short story about the fish fight club I encountered during an exploration. Before we start, please click on the subscribe button and on the bell. It's easy, fast and it will be very helpful. You could also make a donation on our TP page to help us to acquire new underwater equipment. It was a quiet and sunny day. Seb and I, as usual, were out for an exploration in a new area on the Greek coast. We hadn't even taken our cameras with us, because we weren't expecting to spend a lot of time in the water. We were in a hurry. It should have been uh, just a brief inspection. By the way, the site was pretty good. We saw some nice sea stars and big schools of Mediterranean sand melts and sea breams. Before getting back to land, we decided to move to a small isolated rock at the center of the bay. It was a little oasis. There were anemones, sea urchins, some protulas and many fish all around. It was then that I noticed a small tompot blenny lying on a smooth depression about 20 cm below the water surface. I went closer to observe it and suddenly another tompot blenny appeared and charged the first one. It gave a quick bite, then retreated. It stopped a few centimeters from the first blenny, with its side set on it. Then it was first one's turn. It did the same thing. A rapid charge, a quick bite, and then retreat. They continued to look into each other's eyes, and taking turns, they keep on attacking the congener. It was a cruel scene. They were so small, about 8-10 centimeters long but they hung onto each other with such a brutality. And when it was time to come out of the water, the two fish were still there, fighting each other. Analyzing the situation, they were probably fighting for the territory. Maybe one of them had invaded the other one's area. Who knows? However, I didn't expect the two fish to be so aggressive and determined. None of them seemed willing to give up. It was a real fish fight club match. It was a pity we didn't have our cameras with us, and we don't even know who eventually won the fight. Hmm, who do you think got the better of the other? Write your theory in the comment section, and if you witness such a curious scene, share it with us. Fish territoriality is an interesting behavior, it could be a perfect topic for a drops episode. Remember to leave a thumbs up and subscribe to our YouTube channel if you haven't done yet. Don't miss our next videos, see you next week!